Derrick Henry wished he could have played for the Miami Dolphins in 2016, but fate led him to the Tennessee Titans. The Dolphins, happy with their pick, got pro bowler Xavier Howard. While imagining the excitement of having Henry on their team, financial constraints make it unlikely for the Dolphins to sign him now. With Henry seeking a big payday and the Dolphins facing budget challenges, the dream of seeing him in a Miami jersey seems distant. Dolphins fans can only wonder about the missed opportunity. The Miami Dolphins boast an impressive pair of speedsters in their running back lineup with Raheem Mostert and Devon Achain. However, if NFL superstar Derrick Henry had his say, he would have been bulldozing through defenders in the Dolphins' backfield for nearly a decade. In a recent appearance on Barstool Sports Bus in with the Boys Show, Titans RB Derrick Henry revealed to co-hosts Will Compton and Taylor Lewan that he had set his sights on the Dolphins back in 2016. I wanted to go to Miami, Henry expressed. I wanted to play for the Dolphins. That's where I wanted to go. That's where I thought I was going. Despite Henry's desire, the Tennessee Titans nabbed him with the 45th overall pick in the second round. Just seven picks earlier, the Dolphins opted for C.B. Xavier Howard, a decision that has proven to be far from regrettable. Howard has become a multi-time pro bowler, offering solid production over several years in a key position. While Henry could have added an intriguing dynamic to Miami, the Dolphins haven't seen a running back of his caliber since the days of Ricky Williams in the early 2000s. The team hadn't boasted a 1,000-yard rusher since Jay Ajayi in 2016 until 2023. One can only imagine the impact Henry might have had, given Ajayi's success with 1,272 yards and eight rushing touchdowns during the 2016 playoff-bound season. However, the past is in the books, and a reunion between Henry and the Dolphins appears unlikely. With eight years of wear and tear on his body, Henry is eyeing one last significant payday. Unfortunately, Miami, projected to be over $55 million above the salary cap in 2024, has more pressing needs. With several key players set to become free agents, the Dolphins are focused on retaining their core rather than pursuing Henry. As much as fans may dream of Henry bulldozing into the Hard Rock Stadium end zones in a Dolphins jersey, the financial constraints make it improbable. All that remains for Dolphins fans is to ponder what might have been.